Hallihallo! Today I'm gonna show you my morning skincare routine. I filmed this a couple months back when I was still staying in Bali, hence the different location. I will start my day by brushing my teeth and then I'll hop into the shower. Since my hair is bleached at least three times, it needs some special care. For that, I use my Kevin Murphy Hydrate Wash and Rinse. After my hair is done, I start my double cleanse with a very gentle face wash from Simple. This is a very affordable face wash that will give you a soft cleanse. I will cleanse my face until it's super foamy and then step out of the shower. The next step is a little bit weird. I learned it from Sorella Moore and I'm addicted to the step. It is to gently shave your face. It helps to get rid of dry and old skin and supports your skin turnover. Be careful, don't cut yourself and use a razor specially made for your face. The second part of my double cleanse, I use the Liz Earl Cleansing Balm. I've been using it for years now and it's by far my favorite face wash because it nourishes your face while cleaning it. Once I'm out of the shower and dried off, I put on my vitamin C serum. This is the one I used at the moment because it's the only one I could find in whole New Zealand, apparently. This one does its job, but it has a little bit of a sticky finish, which is why I'm looking for a different one. Since vitamin C breaks down really fast, this serum loses its effectiveness after two weeks. Let me know in the comments if you have any recommendations for a nice vitamin C serum. Once a week, I like to do a sheet mask to really hydrate my skin. I stumbled across these Skin Republic sheet masks. They also have some gel masks with retinol and hyaluronic acid and I really love them. I also put them in the fridge before I use them to have a really nice cooling effect. At the moment, I'm trying out the Neutrogena Rapid Wrinkle Repair Serum. I was looking for a cheaper alternative to what I usually use and since I really love the Neutrogena face wipes, I wanted to give this product a chance as well. Another one of my all-time favorites is the Clarence face oil. I have the Blue Orchid one for combination and oily skin. It smells so nice and it gives my skin that extra treat when I need it. I do have acne prone skin, that's why I don't use it every day, only if my skin is very dry. They are a little bit on the pricey side, but one bottle will last a very long time. Just a couple of drops are enough. I always use too much just because I like the smell. Another product I highly recommend are the Clinique eye creams. I use the Clinique All About the Eyes Rich Eye Cream. This is another one of those products which I keep repurchasing. I love how it feels really rich and hydrating. Another product that I'm trying out is the Rapid Wrinkle Repair from Neutrogena but the moisturizer. This is a low price moisturizer but be careful to keep it away from your eyes because they will start to tear up. Last but not least, and actually the most important thing, is sunblock. You can do only so much in moisturizing and hydrating your skin. The sun is the number one factor for skin damage. So even if it's not so sunny, but especially if it's sunny, put on that sunblock. There's a chemical and a physical sunblock. Personally, I prefer the physical sunblock. I found this list from the top zinc-based sunblocks. I'll try out some of these and I'll let you know which one I prefer the most. And I'll leave you all the links in the description box below. So I hope you had fun with this and let me know what you think and if you have any recommendations or if there are any products that you actually like to try it as well. So have fun and see you soon. Bye!